Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel again. So it's been a long time and now I'm going to react back, alright? So I saw Call Me Chris actually collab with Sam and Colby. So I can't wait to see the collaboration right now because I love Sam and Colby so much and also I love Call Me Chris so much, alright? Even though I'm Chris, but you know, this Call Me Chris as well. Let's go! Guys, I love this place, guys. The vibe literally is just so nice. Dude, come on, Messi, come on! Oh, this one's easy. Oh, wait, what about that? There's no way. There's no way. Oh, for Norman. Norman, break your ear, I guess. Yes! Anybody else stressed? I just need to feel something again. I just want to feel an entity. You want to feel an entity? Yeah. Well, you're about to because we're at the Crescent Hotel. Crescent Hotel, everybody. Let's. Wait, do you think that's what Crescent is for? Yeah. Oh, what are you doing? Like, does it amplify ghosts? Call me Chris. Oh my god, that's nice. What? Croissant, like the big croissant hotel. Ghost tours. I think we're going on one later today, actually. The bar. Yes. Why does the ghost go to the bar? For the booze. That's terrible. I love Call Me Chris. Get it. This place is definitely haunted. You can just tell by looking at it. Oh, read the book by the cover. Ominous. Judge. <laughs> Judge. Red thing. It's not just me. God dang it. Should we get in the hot tub later? Honestly, yeah. Haunted hot tub. Haunted hot tub. You guys down? For sure. Ah, let's go. You said no. Yes. Oh. Hey, oh. Oh. It's an omen. How did you time that? You're Jesus. <laughs> We are here with Selena Spooky Boo and Call Me Chris, aka literally the biggest TikTokers in all of Canada. Literally! Yeah! yeah! Oh. So if you guys have not heard of them, you're probably living under a rock, but welcome back. Everyone freaking loves Selena. Thanks, and Chris. Chris yeah. How are you feeling right now? I got a lot to live up to, apparently. <laughs> but I'm excited. I'm terrified. Are you into ghost stuff? I'm super into ghost stuff. Okay, good, because yeah. this is one of the most haunted hotels. I see. I love the paint choice, it's just like black and red. Black and red, yeah. very awesome. Guys, let's, yeah, let's uh, let us skip to the investigation part because, you know, I don't know whether my camera can hold for like one hour, I don't think so. This <laughs> <laughs> Way cooler. So is this who I ask if I need extra pillows in my room? Yes. Okay. Look at his whiskers. They're like ghost receptors. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like some <laughs> Dude, that's adorable. Look at how cute that is. And he's got a little eggs inside just in case he forgets. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this is god. so sick. <laughs> 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 Yes, if you can get through one of these little squares, you're going into a hot tub that's too fine. I'll, I'll do it. I love this color though. This is nice. How do you. <laughs> Wait, what? So now we're locked in. Let's talk to Are you serious? Nightmare, nightmare. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare. <laughs> How do we get out? Uh, Holy shit! Oh, Selena's just stupid. It's like, yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. I'm just gonna get out of here. The Crescent Hotel, a building that's literally been around since 1886. So it was a hotel for majority of the past, but it was also a all women's college, which is interesting because there's actually a story of a student who asked for a Ouija board because she felt weird vibes here. It's all went to shit when a man named Norman Baker, a con man, in 1937 turned this place into a hospital and pretty much tricked hundreds of people saying he could cure their cancer. So after the Great Depression, this town was hurting pretty bad. But Norman Baker came to town as one of the wealthiest people to hit the town and he completely reinvented the place, which was good for the town and that made the townspeople kind of overlook the fact that he might not have the best intentions. He came in, named the hotel Baker Hotel after himself, AKA where the sick folks get well. He was one of these evil how this guy might have been the first person in the entire world to use influence like the radio, he had followers, to sell a product Whoa. that was literally killing people. 
Who else did that in the 1930s? Seriously. Whoa. And probably more what? than this, but there's a documented 44 deaths that happened here because of his cancer treatment. That means minimum two people per month were dying. People are paying so much money. They are emptying their savings accounts to try to heal. He's just taking their money, watching them scream in agony as the cancer gets worse and worse and worse, and then they die. He even created a psych ward section of the hospital where he would send people that were complaining that this formula didn't work and the people that were just screaming in pain from their cancer. So super messed up dude, he was obviously just in it for the money. And it kind of worked. He made millions yeah. off of these dying patients. Everybody believed him. Even the nurses felt like they were actually treating people. And there was only one man in this entire hospital that knew everybody was gonna die. So you might be wondering, how did this guy not get cut? Well, actually the feds were after him for the only two years that he owned this hospital, so they caught him eventually, but all he had to do was pay like a $4,000 fine and spend a few years in prison. He was off scot-free with millions of dollars and he was able to go and live a luxury hotel. You know. There's a famous mirror selfie. Oh, oh man, the mirrors. specific elevator from the second floor that we just did and ride up and down the elevator with them and then when they leave the elevator the person's actually not there clear ass apparitions in this specific elevator all right i hate that nice oh they added that had a sound that's what it was yo dude that Come in here, throw off all their clothes, and go take a shower or something. A lot of people report coming back out of the shower. Everything's folded up nicely. That oh. sounds pretty awesome, actually. That's crazy. You know what that reminds me of? That's the same story of the ghost from Stanley. Yeah, 217 May. Yeah. One theory is that she was actually the nurse for a long time, a head nurse. But because she fell ill with cancer, she actually became a patient at the same place that she was. So isn't that a trip? Like imagine like working with cancer patients, seeing them die and die and die, and then you have cancer, and so you become one of the patients that you've seen dead. Maybe she has some guilt, and that's why she's still here today. But a lot of mediums and psychics who were coming here in the late 90s when this reopened as a hotel thought to have actually talked to Theodora herself, saying that she has a function in- I knew about this and didn't do anything. No, what is this way? What are- Oh no. my god, this is what? so- Oh shit! Look, so at, look at how creepy this it was. It is so cold in here. This smells good as hell! Look so at that little door! There's no door knob. There's no door knob. Is that where this Theodora is, sleeps? Yeah, he's gonna come out and tell you guys You're gonna wake up? Door's a woman. Open. Just kidding. He, she's gonna come out. Why are you assuming her gender? Why would they make oh, it so much shot. creepier? <gasps> it's nailed shut. It's nailed Why shut. do you need to do that? I don't know. Isn't that one of his secret passages? Probably. Maybe. Maybe. There are some of them. Quite possibly. Enormous <gasps> secret passage. Oh, is that her? Oh my God! She's gonna watch you sleep. We've fallen off of our third floor balcony and landed in our garden here. Not over here, but over here. <laughs> right over in this area here. The balcony that she is actually seen falling from is that third floor balcony right there. We've actually had reports from some of our guests who have been... I'm here for you, so. <laughs> <laughs> now, ladies, keep in mind, it might just feel like a caress of cheek, patting up your hair, maybe even a little tickle on the sides. I'm oh, sorry. Okay. There you go. Whoa! <laughs> Michael is actually considered our original spirit. Like the, the first one ever? Yes, he actually died in the making of this hotel. He was actually working way up high in the building one day. He sees a beautiful young lady passing down below and decides, hey, I need to get her attention. Probably doing a little hoot and holler and maybe even a little Irish jig. Slips. <laughs> That's hot. No, he slips, falls to the hotel, and lands on a beam that is now part of room 218. Oh my god. If you're watching this, don't cat call girls or else you're gonna die. <laughs> We've also had women who were in the bathroom having a shower. I, I, you talked to us. You are so psychic. Oh, I was like, he's gonna watch me in the shower. <laughs> she needs to do that. Did you just turn British? British? She needs to do that. Yeah, I just went, I don't know why I went British. Was it English? Like, actually Irish. Irish. Oh, that's pretty cool. Irish. 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 What's your I Irish? Irish, yeah. I can do Irish. Yeah, for sure. Well, hey, well, you can do anything for Michael. Yeah. I can do whatever Michael wants. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't he 17 then? He was 17. Oh, my God. Oh. That's my statement. <laughs> It's like a hundred thousand. That's considered a little bit well. There's also been instances with men. He doesn't quite like them being around.
on the ladies. He kind of sees it as a mm, challenge. Competition? <laughs> yes. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go, Michael. Catch it. Did we turn the light on here? I don't remember doing that. That's, That's our room. Oh, the buffet? We never turned that light on. Did you turn that on? Wait, what the heck is going on right now? You didn't turn that on? Um, That's our room oh. right there with the lamp on, and none of us turned it on. Did you turn the light Wait, have you been to your room since? Nope. I didn't touch the yeah. light switch. Did okay, you touch cool. the light switch? No, no there was no lights in any room, I don't think. I mean, we could look back on the footage, but I don't think so. Maybe we're just yeah. stupid. I don't know. Maybe we're stupid, or maybe it's haunted. <laughs> and I'm scared now. It's spooky. Right now, we have a full-on camera. Oh. Gonna ca what? Sorry. Sorry. What? I'm sorry. No, you're good. What did you say? What no, the no, no, fuck no, no, just no, happened? No, 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 because I don't want to believe what I'm doing. No, wait, wait, wait. It's in our room. No, Chris, What the fuck did you just say? Wait. No, you're good. Chris, what did you see? Chris, what'd you see? Oh, Holy shit. shit. Are you gonna cry? Yeah. Oh my Are god. Are you serious? Wait, wait you what the fuck? That was fucking insane. What did you see? Literally somebody standing in the window in our room. Holy so shit. Weird. Look at my fucking I don't goosebumps. Want to sleep oh my god. I just got goosebumps. I don't know why. Yo, are you okay? Dude? Yeah, I think it's gonna be fine, but it's really scary. Right now, we have a full-on camera. Oh what? Sorry, sorry. No fucking way. <laughs> I'm scared. Are you scared? Is that like the yeah. first time you've ever seen something like that? No, it's not. No, it's you not. used to see them, though? Yeah, when I was younger. But only, only twice. And it just happened again? What are the odds? Well, if you want to sleep in our room... Yeah, we can no, swap. your room. <laughs> I was gonna say, our room is so much scarier. I felt, yeah, way more, like... Chills in your room. Did you see what it looked like at all? Tall, like like up to that windowsill, like up to the in the middle. That camera was recording. Who knows? It, maybe it just doesn't show up on camera. I cannot believe that just happened. Yo, I haven't seen I'm anyone sorry. like okay? freak yeah, out like no, that. I'm, hey, I just you weren't ready. No, you, you, no you're here, but you're at the same time you're never that. ready. It's one thing to like want to see something, but then when it actually happens, it's, it's different. No, it was very very different. Yo. It was like not that wasn't a woman. Well, Michael was seventeen. If this was like a taller man, but figure. floor two was his. That's his floor. That's his floor. That's his floor. Oh shit! What if he's waiting in the room? Yo! Oh, oh my god! I don't want it. We're gonna cast some things out of there. Yeah, I was gonna say. Holy fuck! Maybe we should go investigate your room, dude. <laughs> holy shit! We have to now. I feel like we need to like at least call that. While we go around and investigate these other places, I would be curious to put that camera in your room. Room, yes. Like full time. Oh, just because if there's another noise, you're not sleeping there. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> that's, uh, yeah, that's, that's crazy. Are you okay? Yeah. Are you good? I'm not joking at all. Like, I don't have any. Uh, dude, you start crying immediately. I know, I know. It was, was it like a glimpse it was glimpse? This, or was it like you could no, see? No, no, like I. It was so fast, but I know what I I know what I saw. Yeah, that was like on the stairs. I know what I saw. Like, it was I know windows. that it was up to that middle window sill thing, and it was. Can you? Hey, we're coming down the stairs. Maybe you and the spirits can't leave. Oh they know that that's your room. They know that we're coming. This no, is the beginning. Did he just move? Did you... No, I didn't touch that. I thought, I thought you touched that. I didn't. Whoa. Just move. Did... What the fuck? Ooh. A minute, and then we can come in after. Okay. What the fuck was that? What? This? Oh, my fucking key just moved! Did you no, I didn't touch that! I, I thought you touched that! I didn't... What? Wait, no, I literally thought you just... What the fuck just moved? I have chills all over my body. Did you see that? I heard it. I, I heard, did heard did that too! No, I thought, I literally thought you were holding it. It felt like somebody was going like... I heard that. 100... Yo, are you okay? You don't have to! Holy shit, you do not have to do this! That's fine. Oh, my I don't remember um, putting this lamp on, but when I saw whatever the fuck, whatever the heck I saw. Guys, my friend is so noisy. Hold on, guys. Oh, all right, let's continue. Uh, it was standing about in the middle of the room, almost like on the table, like right here. And it was as tall as like the middle of this window sill, which is probably about like six feet, six, probably like six, two, six, three. I don't know. 
Selena, real note. Have you ever seen her like this before? I've never seen Chris like this in my life. She is genuinely affected right now. Yeah, no, I feel bad, bad dude. Like, I feel I bad. Feel bad. You too, I, I, that was just a joke. Like, you're coming like, there This shows everybody that, like, this shit is real. It's them saying this it's not us. This is the first, first time. Do you hear two voices? Two Listen voices. Is she talking to somebody? I heard two voices. Oh my god. I'm sweating. I'm sweating? Oh my god, okay. Let's just go in the bathroom. Because we were was down to there. It was yeah. fast, like a shot was super fast. No, no, no that makes sense. sense. It was just like there. Just standing there. Yeah. Did you see out over this light? I was just thinking that high. That's okay. yeah. He was trying to make himself seen. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. That's crazy. You were just talking to somebody in here. Because we could have sworn we were like two huh? voices. Oh, I was talking to myself. Whispering. Did you hear another voice? Huh? Yeah. No, I didn't hear another voice. I heard two voices. What the fuck were you recording? Yeah, we were yeah. recording out there too. Okay, I didn't hear that with that because I was talking to myself and I was just, I, I can't remember what I said. I was just explaining how tall I was. <laughs> <laughs> camera got it too. Yeah, I, I literally thought you were like already no. trying to go in. <laughs> okay, let's go. Welcome let's to the Sam and Gooby channel. Like and subscribe. <laughs> There's two dancers, one Irene and Vernon Castle. Oh, it's very Done now with the music, which just got in trouble. I just reset the robot again, and it was off. So I think that was janky, but that was not. That's so far. That was what 15 feet away from it. Oh my God! Have you ever that one has always had problems? Oh my God! Wait, these things don't just like randomly glitch. That's never no. like it's not. It's not working. Like you said, they're like cat toys. Like what? what it took her that much? That is how hard you have to be that next to it. Or touch it. If these were like ghosts that were dancing in a ballroom, what if it was just kind of like a residual thing and they're moving all around this? We stepped on it. It wasn't doing anything. We start dancing and then boom. It's not like this one. Like if it was this right here, I'd be like, ah, it's probably us hitting it or whatever. Yeah. yeah. You know what's weird is that it feels like the air in the room is moving when we came into it. So let's go. Oh my, okay, it just got so much crazy. So terrible. Here we go. Some of them. Get right on it. Oh, oh, oh my god. Wait, this is the tissue? Some of it's tissue. Some of it's just medicine. Some of it we don't even know. So some of this can be the Formula 5. Actually, we believe that this may be. The same size bottles right here. One thing oh. that I have been told by a guest. Now they aren't for sure themselves. They are in the healthcare themselves, even possibly a doctor. They said that this might just be body fat. Oh, oh god. god. Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah. It does look oh. like it. Oh, I love a good dig pic, you know? Uh, enunciate that one. Dig. Dig. dig pic. Yeah, yeah dig pic. That's <laughs> 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 And then, of course, right here we have the same locker that the heat signature had lit up on the number two during those lockers. Me and Grant were looking at the locker. We kept seeing the two glowing red. There's really no reason why that two should be red. It's something we've never caught or seen before. You're what are you saying? Norman Baker I said he's you? like kind of a decent looking guy and I think he could have swindled me into thinking he could cure my cancer. <laughs> That is probably why, honestly, he was able to swindle so many people. Because he was like a charismatic, good at looking yeah, guy. Yeah, it's like a, a Ted Bundy kind of thing. <laughs>
Close behind and you. That door is like solid. Like that's a This is a door. fat door, guys. Do you close people in there? I guess Jim. What if you close just one person or is that still? You're putting me in there too. You see it? Everything's kinda red. My god, this is my club sound. So just wait for a bit, wait for a bit guys, wait for a bit, right? Looking through a red thing. There's someone in here with us, can you make a sound? Did you hear that? Slimy sound? There's somebody in there. Dude! Dude! What? 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 Said if there's anyone in here that's making a sound and then it kind of sounded like if you pulled plastic off a couch. This is an automatic writing planchette. So you use it the same way, but instead of a board, it has a pencil right here and draws out certain objects. Both times we tried this, we got weird crazy things. If you feel that it needs to be pushed forward, push forward. Yeah. He's just really looking at us. Okay, he's really, oh my God, that's yeah. really fucking creepy. I'll play this again, but you went like this and, and something went, behind. Uh, Did you hear yeah. that? Yeah. If there's anything down here that wants to show themselves or talk to us, feel free to use our MD to push this pencil back and forth. Oh my goodness. We're gonna take one hand off, paper keeps slipping. There we go, it's way better. Is that it? What the fuck? What is this doing? That's the weird thing is. Guys, don't ever play Ouija board, guys. Even though this one, Still, you don't, don't play it, you know. This isn't like I'm looking at everyone's hands and it doesn't seem like no, anyone's I'm pushing, not pushing it. It doesn't take much to push this one. <laughs> what the fuck? It looks like an S. S. Or a 2. Or an 8. Why don't you come with me? What the Whoa, fuck? Where, where the that? fuck did you come from? <laughs> oh my god! Oh, this is twice. This is the picture, guys. Check it out. Oh, oh, oh my fucking god! Oi, oi. No, it's in bubble letters. It's in bubble oi. letters. No, that doesn't fucking look like a two. Oh my god. Oh my oh fucking god. god. There's no way. There's absolutely no way. It's in bubble letters. No, that's too real. Wait, there's no fucking way. How in the fuck? You know what's even weirder, dude? Oh it my has god. like little marks like this. Wait, no, but there's... Like the blowing. Yep, on the ghost hunters. Ghost hunters, they caught like oh. an apparition right next to here. Why is that locker? What is, what is, what is that locker? Guys, this place is the monster. I know. You, 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 are, you are making it too, right? No one was making it. I never even saw this cabinet. I moved my fingers. Our guy here. Yeah, we did, okay. not, we did not set up this scene or anything. Like, come on, guys. Oh. Oh, really? Getting worse. Let's go, 10 more minutes. Just for shits and giggles, I'm gonna start recording right now. We're gonna see if anything's changed about your room. Lights still on and cameras right there. All right, maybe your place isn't haunted. What are you looking at? What's wrong? Wait, what's wrong? What the fuck? I made a mental note that this towel was draped. Sorry, it's here right now. Was draped over the bathtub like this before we left because I was just like I was just checking everything. everything out what the f actually yeah. a towel fucking moved are you kidding me I'm not joking I wonder if when I was recording because I did go in the bathroom like when I went in here by myself maybe you touched it no 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 not if I touched it or if I got it where it was draped so then we could like it actually fit. Uh, oh it's draped over see it right there oh my it's god it's not it's oh great door! Actually, it's 100% on camera. It's, it's a weird. Oh. It was folded when you found it, or what? It was draped over the bathtub. 
she was drinking in the bathroom, oh, and right she now. just found it in the corner. Holy shit. Right there, look. Oh. From like zero oh. to literally 100 in the first fucking video. I think it's because we brought you fucking pass with us. Holy shit. What the fuck? We do this all the time, and I cannot believe this. Huh? I have Are a lot you good? Yeah, it, no, 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 I'm not good. No, I'm not good. I'm not good. I'm not, good. I'm not okay. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. It's so Sorry. fucked when it really happens. That's the thing. Like, when, when things actually happen, you're like, yeah, this is fun, it's cool, crazy things are happening. But they keep happening, your brain keeps trying to rationalize it. It's like, well, there's just no fucking rationalization If there wasn't that footage, I would just, like, try to convince myself. Yeah. I'm like, no, like... I, like we, we haven't even used this we haven't used this hotel room yet like yeah. nothing's been touched only when we're coming in together yeah like this. in this in this in this room That's like it. the only time I went in there was when I took the camera in there and just like looked right because there. I wanted to see if anything was in there nothing I have another scary thing to say. Okay. Tell me this doesn't look like oh, lips, a nose, oh and a chin. Wait, what? It is. Bro, do you oh see this? God. Look at this. Yeah, yeah like someone peering in. in. Nose. Like you see the something. nostrils, and then the chin is pressed up. Yeah. Like, like, like it's looking like it's like. You can see, it looks like it's going like this. Like you can see. Like you kiss. Something was looking in there. Nose, lips, chin. You can see what the nostrils are even. It it's, never is. It's non-stop, guys. Most haunted hotel in America. We're thinking it's getting late past one o'clock now. So we're thinking we'll do our last investigation in the most haunted room of the hotel. Best case scenario, try to talk to everything at once. So we're going to invite any spirit that's here, anything that's been showing themselves to us throughout the entire night, anything that's been moving the gathering towel in the bathroom. If you want to come up with us, you're welcome to follow us just to our next room. You guys ready? Last one. Guys, if you want us to continue doing haunted hotels, like this video. If this gets 200,000 likes, we will go to another top 10 most haunted hotel in America, just for you guys. And subscribe while you're down there, please. It takes two seconds and makes us happy in a very sad time. Just most of our lives. Really? Yeah. All right, let's go to Theodore's room. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Please, be Sam. Please be Victorian Theodore, please. Oh my god. It's definitely Sam. Are you ready to summon Norman Bacon? Oh my god! What the fuck? Oh my god, thank you. You said you were going to the bathroom. What the shit? I'm ready to summon Norman Bacon. It's for men. Come on, man. Ready for the summon your demons. Where did you get this from? His favorite. <laughs> Theodora? Methods of work in progress. Um, it was. Or anything like that. Okay. And it has a dick with us with words. We are in the. It's blue. I'm wearing purple for Norman Baker. It's blue. What? It's blue. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> it's fucking blue. If this color is blue, can you go up and tap the blue flashlight? Go up to that, hit it, and it'll turn on. Yodora, are you with us? Can you turn this off right here? Could it be Norman? Oh my god, if your name is Norman Baker, if you recognize the name Norman Baker, can you turn off that red flashlight? Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know if that's because you stood up like that, that's but like, do you not like talking about Norman Baker? Can you let us know if you want us to change the subject? Did Michael follow us up here? Oh shit! <gasps> oh, oh, oh my god! Oh my god! I don't like it! I don't like it! I don't like it! I don't like it! I don't like it, Michael! No! Can you turn off that blue flashlight? If your name is Michael, on three, one, two.
<laughs> if you speak right into this device right here, we can hear you. Wait, is the AC on? Didn't we turn that off? The AC's off. It's on. I felt a cold breeze go this way, like on the back of my neck. Uh, can you give us a hint on who you are? We'd love to hear your story and speak to you directly. Occupation or your name? <laughs> Did you work here at the hotel? If so, can you turn that flashlight off? Oh, okay. Michael worked here, right? Wasn't he a construction person? Maybe it is time for that system, so we can get more clear answers. So we have this piece of ghost equipment called the Spirit Box. If you come up and talk to it, we can hear exactly what you're saying through radio frequencies. If you'd like to use that form of communication, could you give us a sign, an obvious sign, turn on one of these flashlights, or... Turn on, turn on. Oh. Why did you set up one of these flashlights? Whoa. Whoa. Now for everybody's favorite part, the Estes method. This is a spirit box. It's gonna shift through just random radio waves and then you're just like, Might as well. Okay. You're like, so fun! <laughs> I love it! You don't already? Chris is doing this. I'm probably gonna die soon, so just give me a pity follow. Hey. Perfect. No man. No, no man. man. Who didn't like men? It was somebody who didn't like men. Michael! Michael! Michael didn't like men! Is this Michael? Oh, I want you. Oh my fucking god! That's exactly what I'm saying. That exactly. Michael, do you want Chris? Bro, no. Yeah, or it's like, or like sexual. Can you tell me where you are now? I can hear the cigarette. I'm going to. Where are you going? What are you gonna do? I've worked here. You work with patients? Children. Or with children's wing. wing. There was a children's wing. This could be a nurse. Or a multi Can you give us a hint on who you are? What's going on? War. Civil War was like in the same. We era. are. We do the survive both World War I and Gone. Are we are gone? Here? Empath. Whoa. Can you tell that Chris is an empath? Have you been showing yourself to Chris all night? Patience. Uh oh. A that? man. Are you the man that Chris saw in the bedroom, in the hotel room? God was here. Were you watching us from the window when we were outside? I'm in the room. What the fuck? Oh, where are you? It's so clear. I don't know what is going on. Where are you in the room? Can you point or show us? I think he said, are you, were you in the room, like the, our room that we saw in the window? He said, and he said, I'm, I'm oh. in the room. Were you in the window? I never saw him. He's in there right now. In the corner. Oh, what the fuck? In this corner? Are glass. You... Glass? No, no, they're talking about the other room. The corner, the glass at the window. So this person was in the corner of the room, and she said, I want you, girl, at the beginning. Holy shit. I think this is Michael. Can you confirm? Can you say yes? I like to dance. Were you in the ballroom with us? Have you been following us all night? Can you confirm that you're Michael? That's all we want to know. What's your job? I'm here. here. Oh my god! Yeah. Holy shit! Holy Let's go. Is it shit. good? Oh yes. my god! It does feel like you're like I I I forgot you guys were here. We just said, are you are you Michael? Can you just confirm that you're Michael? And you said I'm here. Oh my so cool. god! Was like, oh, geez, right at the there. beginning. It First, I got chills all up my body when it's... Holy like that. shit! Because that was like the most clear thing. I don't think Michael's a bad spirit. No, he is. I think he was just following us the entire night and trying to just get Chris's attention because we made jokes. What? We made jokes since... Yes. And, and we were like talking and you said something about not liking men. Right. You okay? What? Oh, somebody's popping in the other rooms? What time is it? It's like two. Go, 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 go. Just open for a second and then close. Oh my god. This entire investigation. It just makes so much sense. Wild. He showed us up to you and then talked to you. Yeah. Holy shit. Selena was targeted. Oh, really?
All right, guys. So that's it from me today. Uh, it was amazing. I love this uh, episode, but I hope I can watch another one, right? So make sure to comment down below what, which episode you want me to react to, right? So I'll see you guys in the next one. As always, Christopher Quentin signing out. Peace.